got them. I don't know what this is. But... Oh, it's a Laker. It's a Laker. It's a Laker. It's a Laker. It's a good one, too. It's a good one, too. She's gonna fight me now. Stay on, baby. Stay on. Gotta get this out of the way. Stay on, baby. It's a big leak choke. Go on. Do your thing. Go, 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 go. Okay, that's the sound. It's a big leg trout. Big leg trout on the Irish flare, guys. Big leg trout. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. <laughs> she goes back down on bottom. Yeah, baby. Oh, it's a big fish. Man, I love those rods. See, that's why you get the butt handle here like this. That's why I designed it like this. Ah, oh, man, this fish owning me right now. I'm just, just lifting it off bottom. Oh yeah. Let her get tired. Keep the pressure. That's why I use a long rod like this. Keep pressure on her, but not too much. I don't see her, but... It's not even light out. It's still dark. Patience, patience. Can't force it. <laughs> Fish. Let her get tired. Let her get tired. Let, you, let the rod do the work. See? Push in. Really? The iris flare, man. Holy moly. Putting work on them. All right, she's coming up now. 17 feet. You guys can see her on the graph. I can see her. It's a big fish. It's not a natural. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. He's right here. I got him, dude. Oh, this feels good. That's a good fish. Not long, but here you go. That's what she bit right here, the iris flare. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Josh is lucky, that's 32, 33 inch. She's not that long. I'd love to go outside and get a couple pictures. Beautiful Lake Simcoe, Lake Trout. She goes back in. She wants to go right away. See, look how dark it is. You know what looks a lot like this? That's what it looks a lot like. I don't know if you guys can see with the lighting, but this Thule perch looks a lot like this goby. But in this case, I caught it on the iris flare, but they come up here and they're feeding on gobies because the smell population is not as great. Man, I saw him eat that, that's pretty cool. Man, that Irish flare is pretty badass. Give me a little 
buddy. Oh, yeah. Man, they're eating those things pretty good, those lip lips, man. Pretty good. I think we got something going on with the Aries Flare. I'm sure they bite a Thule Perch, too. I just don't have it tied on. You gotta have sauce. You gotta have sauce on if you're gonna catch a whitefish on a lipless. Oh, you so upset. But that's a good whitey right here. Okay, okay. <laughs> he did not want to be here. And he fought good for a whitey, so. What the hell, man? I'm on the phone, and I got a whitefish on. <laughs> it's a good one. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? I hope my camera got that down there. It's a good one, too. Ooh, it's a good whitey. Ooh. We don't want to pitch outside with that. On the workout drifter. Just just lifted my rod and I'm like, where's my bait? In the fish's mouth. That's a good fish. I'll take a picture of that. This big white fish goes back. He was pumped to go. That's how you activate them. You press the button. There you go. So I know I'll get asked, so I gotta say it. Caught it on the workout drifter. I like the darker color because it imitates Whew. these gobies. Right? That's why I like the darker colors. Match the edge. Darker gobies are getting eaten. All right, uh, I'm gonna pack up and uh, go fish some stuff around. Just punch some holes with the sled, see if I can catch a lake trout, be Josh. Make my way home. It's the weekend, it's a short afternoon, but it's uh, Super Bowl very soon. <laughs>